Howdy y'all, this is uh, another listener requested poem, Kubla Khan by Samuel Taylor Coleridge. In Xanadu did Kubla Khan a stately pleasure dome decree, where Alf the sacred river ran through caverns measureless to man, down to a sunless sea, so twice five miles of fertile ground, with walls and towers girded round, and there were gardens bright with sinuous rile, where blossom many an incense-bearing tree, and here were forests ancient as the hills, enfolding sunny spots of greenery. But oh, that romantic chasm which slanted down the green hill, athwart of seed and cover, a savage place, as holy and enchanted as e'er beneath a waning moon was haunted by women wailing for her demon lover. And from this chasm, with ceaseless turmoil seething, as if this earth in flat thick pants were breathing, a mighty fountain momentarily was forced, amid whose swift half-intermittent burst huge fragments vaulted like rebounding hail, or chaffy grain beneath the thresher's flail, and mid these dancing rocks at once and ever, I flung up momentarily the sacred river, five miles meandering with a mazy motion, through wood and dale and sacred river ran, that reached the caverns measureless to man, and sank in the tumult of a lifeless ocean, and mid this tumult Kubla heard from afar ancestral voices prophesizing war. The shadow of the dome of pleasure floated midway on the waves, where he heard the mingled measure from the fountain and the caves. It was a miracle of rare device, a sunny pleasure dome with caves of ice, a damsel with a dulcimer in a vision I once saw. It was an Abyssinian maid, and on her dulcimer she played, singing of Mount Abor, I could revive within me her symphony of song, to such deep delight t'would win me, that with music loud and long I would build that dome in air, that sunny dome, those caves of ice, and all who heard should see them there, and all should cry, beware, beware, his flashing eyes, his floating hair, weave a circle round him thrice, and close your eyes with holy dread, for he on honey-dew hath fed and drunk the milk of paradise. Excellent, excellent stuff, folks. That was our poem of the week, Kublai Khan. Till next time.